I suppose I could. Normal mode, okay. I'm gonna die really, really quickly. But, okay. Um, let's see, so I've got... That's the three ships I've got. Uh, let's do a let's do a Kestrel run. We'll try normal. Okay. Now, when this doesn't work, I'm blaming Anne entirely. <laughs> you expect me to die, so it's okay. That, that's fine then, so long as we're of one accord. Ooh, move the camera down a little bit. There we go. Okie doke. Right. That's giving me a weird glare off the glasses at the moment. That's for when we do a. Okay. Okie doke, right. Kestrel on normal, and away we go. Uh, I can see this going very, very badly. Right, firstly, move those two round, turn that on. I'll turn that on as well for the moment, but I'm not. Um, see, let's turn that off, turn that on. Um, okay, so you start with less scrap as well. Okay, didn't know that. Um, okay. I don't know. I don't know what the differences are with the normal, so we'll see how it goes. Uh, well, got no real choice. Got to go to that one. Your scans revive a mining base on a nearby planet long since abandoned. No life signs detected. Okay. I will learn. It will it will take me time, but I will learn. I see it's especially well armed. Always a worry. Always a worry. Uh, right, we're not going to surrender. Okay, so we just want to be heading straight for their weapons. Um, yeah, I'm sure they'll turn up at some point. Ah, they have a Zoltan shield, so we've got to get through that first. Okay, not too bad, could have been worse. Fire right, that again. Okay, hit me in non-essential areas, that's fine. Oh, finally get through the shields and what happens? Miss everything. There we go, started getting the weapons down, that's better. I can't get through the shields, that's good. Okay. Cool, keep going. Getting them, getting them down. Um, ooh, an extra crew member. Uh, extra crew member would be useful. Yeah, go on. Then. 
I'm still far at you. No, it's a shame. Um, right, Mr. Fox, you go and work in a shield area. So, Anne, you got anything uh, planned for Halloween at this point? Again, just going to go straight after that. <laughs> I survived the first fight. <laughs> yeah, I think at this point it's going to be a case of if I survive, it will be a celebration for surviving any of the fights. Ah, okay, that's bad. No, no not that there. Uh, I'm going to turn on the Artemis. Turn that down one, turn that back on. That's not good. That's not good. Okay, that's really not good. The moment is... Just stop shooting my ship. Good, okay. So he's able to turn things off, but he's not able to uh, actually do me any damage at the moment, so that's fine. You're going to Gothenburg to visit a couple of friends. Ah, yes, I think you did say that to me before. Well, I do hope you enjoy yourself. I'm going to be um, turning all the lights off and doing the, uh, the the classic Five Nights at Freddy's for 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 Halloween, and I'm going to I'm going to stream Five Nights at Freddy's. Well, they're nearly dead, so it's good. Uh, the first Five Nights at Freddy's. Yeah, I'm I'm probably going to get a couple of uh, at least two or three of the versions of it, and I'm going to try and get through a, a, a few versions of it. I'll start with the first one and move my way along, uh, working on the basis that I actually get through any of the games. But yeah, that's my plan basically. Um, I, mean, I don't know whether I should start with that one or not, or, or get one that's slightly more up to date. Don't really want to be. <laughs> Good luck, yeah. I've seen some of the YouTube videos, so I've seen people getting the shit scared out of them, so. That's goody. Med bay, turn on the Artemis. Okay, so he's got droid. He's got a lot of weapons. Alright, we need to get that up and running. Jesus Christ, already? Okay, their weapons are well and truly down. No way, mate. Cool. Yeah, I've only seen them played. I, I don't personally know, so it's definitely going to be interesting. Uh, wrist, uh, let's have a quick look at the crew. What's Immune to fire, max health and crit. Okay. You go and repair that first. Especially seeing as you're immune to fire, that'd be useful. Yeah, supposedly it uh, it gets you sort of. You end up watching it quite closely, so you end up. Uh, 
jumping at it. So some cheap jump scares at my uh, at my expense for Halloween is what I'm looking at. Okay, now go and repair that. Alright, go and heal while that gets oxygen in it. You want to be the engine person, which is at the moment Brian. Um, I'm going to be the rock. There we go. Oh, uh, I need to turn the medbay on. Oops. That's going, that's going to be a big downfall later. I'll, I'll send people into the medbay to heal and I won't have turned it on. Healed, uh, so you can go back into the shields. Good, okay. We're doing about as well as we can at this point. A distress beacon is coming from a civilian ship and appears to be being chased by a pirate. Aid the civilian ship or stay out of it. My hull is damaged, but can't just leave them to be on their own. Okay, so we've got a drone, uh, the weapons, okay. I need to be able to upgrade my shields really, that would be the biggest thing to help at the moment. Uh, let's turn that back off, turn that on. No, no, I called myself Viper from... I don't know actually, it was a long time ago, but back uh, in 1998 is when I first created the uh, my, my Yahoo account with that name. And I don't know, I, th I guess it's so, I literally just thought it sounded cool. I thought that, yeah, I call myself Viper, Viper sounds cool. That's pretty much it, it's about as exciting as, uh, as the story goes. I shouldn't need to use any more missiles now. I can keep that down. Well, thank you. I like to. I like to think so, obviously. Should in theory be all done. Good, good. Nice. Okay, we've got distress beacon over there. I'm just very, very wary about my health, and that doesn't take me anywhere, so I've got to go to this one. Across a pirate in hot pursuit of an unidentified ship. Um, well, it is, other than if you take a look at my hull. I do need to be finding a store as quickly as possible, really. Um, right, firstly, let's. I want to take a missile to send a missile to there. Let's just do as much damage to the weapons as quickly as possible. Really? Jeez, that was terrible. Everything missed. 
Ooh, I think I must have caused a fire or something in there. The weapon system went offline. Interesting. As long as I can get their weapons down, I should be okay. Through this uh, this fight, okay. I do need to find a store though. Keep them. No, keep that going. That's fine. Cool. Okay. Uh, the pirate explodes, leaving behind a substantial collection of useful scrap materials. Okay. Ooh, and some... Ah, oh, that's what I needed. I needed some... I needed my hole to be repaired. Okay. So let's move on to here. Keeping just ahead of the... Um, oh, it's quarantined. Okay. And we'll jump to the next one. By the time you notice the rebel ship behind the beacon, it's too late to avoid a fight. Okay. Well, I've got to wait for things to charge up. Uh, let's start by taking that down. And that down. The drone on its own can't actually do anything to me. Because it can't get through my shield, so that's fine. I can cope with that. Not going to use missiles unless I need to. Good, keep that down. The tunes in this call. going to be nearly down now. Actually, looking at that, I really ought to, once this fight is done, there we go, uh, turn the... nice, very nice, turn that off, turn that on, you go to the med bay, and John go to the med bay. Right, you go back to engines, and... Yes, Artemis is the missiles. Yep. Uh, but to use missiles, up here you have a number of missiles that you have. So I generally try not to use the missiles if I can because it depletes that number. So I, to be honest, I generally have that turned off. But early on it's useful because I don't have a secondary weapon at the moment. Okay, let's go to the distress signal. I need better weapons, but I need money to do it. A small civilian ship flies over as soon as you arrive. They're preparing to fight, but uh, they're prepared to fight, but they just inform you that they're out of FTL fuel and can't jump. Well, I've got 17 at the moment, so I'll actually give them the fuel, and we get some extra scrap. That will be very useful. It is because it bypasses the shields. That's one of the first things, the, the things about missiles is that they bypass the shields. Okay, uh, you pick up an automated message from a nearby space station. There appears to be a local shipwright who can perform emergency work on military ships. Inquire about their speciality. Um, upgrade to reactor for some scrap for 25. I think my reactor I can upgrade for 20 at the moment, so no. Thank you, but no. Yeah. At the moment I can do 20. Uh, right, jump. I could go to one more and get back again, but I don't want to waste the fuel. Okay, so we've got an uncharted nebula or pirate controlled, which means we're going to probably get a lot of fights in pirate controlled. 
yeah, so that's why I generally I want, I want to save up some missiles to make sure I've, I've got enough for later fights. Um, nebulas are bad. I'm going to go to the pirate controlled area. I prefer that to nebula. Oh, no, straight into a nebula. Uh, a few years ago, this region was bustling with trade activity. Now it's overrun with bandits and marauders. We should tread lightly here. Okay. Is it all nebula? I hope not. Okay. No, it's just that little section there that's nebula, so it should be okay. I'm going to jump to there. There are only two ships within range they seem to be engaged in battle. One of them has the markings of a space pirate. Um, we'll aid the civilian ship. Okay. Not quite as bad as I was expecting. They've got a laser of some sort. Can't see what's on the other side. That's a bomb. That's a bomb. I don't know how long that takes to charge. That's what we need. We need them th that down. That's good. Yeah, so generally what I do with missiles um, is I'll use that to take down the shields and then let my lasers do the rest of the work. Is useful, so ah, that's what I'm looking for. Let's jump to the store. I need weaponry. Receive a wide band automated message. Welcome to our humble trade depot and shipyard. All are welcome, but try and any funny business on our 152 automated turret satellites will tear your ship to shreds. Oh, okay, oh, okay. Uh, let's grab the fuel. Always grab the fuel. Pike beam, heal beam. Pike beam can cut across entire ships, assuming there's no shield to stop it. It's not the kind of weapon I was really hoping for. And drone control is too much at this point. I think I'd prefer to upgrade my ship at this point. I need more I need more lasers rather than um, beam weapons at the moment. You saw how badly I did with beam weapons last night, um, Tuesday night. Uh, so I'm going to upgrade the ship. Step one of that is I'm going to get a couple of points in there, a couple of points in there, upgrade my shields. Give them two layers of shields I've got to try and get through now. Okay, I've got a distress signal here, so let's try to do that. Uh, okay, you find the source of the distress call, a small research station. Yeah, beams were bad. Though, I think the worst thing, that the, the reason I really had major problems with that last boss fight, one, I wasn't micromanaging enough, but two, I went into that previous fight, got boarded, didn't deal with the border, but then went straight into the boss fight with the border still on the ship. So I was like in serious trouble at that point. Uh, okay, let's try using the rock crew. The rock, crew, uh, the rock soldier tears through the airlock directly into the fire. You've never seen someone that large move that fast. It disperses as much fire suppressant as possible into the heart of the blaze and eventually the fire starts to die down. Contact the survivors. Ooh, 30 scrap and a automated reloader which I think reloads my weapons 10% faster let's just check uh, cooldown between weapon shops is improved by 10% yep excellent that's gonna be useful okay moving along don't need to go to the store at this point uh, well we'll pop there just see if we've got any weapons of any sort 
Okay. Don't need a scrap recovery arm. Not too worried about that at the moment. Heavy laser, 50. Powered one. Heavy lasers can wreak more havoc than their smaller burst counterparts. Uh, nine seconds. Only requires one power, which is the same as running the Artemis. I'm actually going to get that. Swap that over with the Artemis. Um, turn that off, turn that on. There we go. So now I've got two laser weapons going. That's good. Okay. No, we've got plenty of time, so I'm going to do a couple of jumps around the exit before I leave. See if we can uh, get any more improvements. A small pirate ship messages you. That sure is a shiny ship you got there. You fire a warning shot across their bow and they respond, hey, no need for violence, it was just a comment. Oh, okay, that's just a pirate saying hi. Okay, so we'll go to that one. As soon as you arrive, a small ship decloaks behind yours. Um, oh, okay. King Sky, good evening. How are you doing? Good to see you again, buddy. Alright, jump to... Uh, this beacon has been placed too close to a super giant M class star. I am I'm running on normal. Thanks to Anne, yeah, yeah. Anne, Anne talked me into doing normal. We've got a hope. Uh, the ship will gradually overheat until you get out of here or die. The pirate apparently oblivious to the danger of the sun moves in to engage. Okay. Uh, let's just get the weapons up and running. Take that down, take that down. Okay, I need to time these a bit better. Okay. I want to fire that, then that. A pirate interceptor. Six missiles is nice. Let's get out of there. Okay, uh, yeah, you get out of there. You go and repair that. This could pose problems. Ah, uh, I decided to be nice this time. Leave me alone. Okay, that's not too bad. You get out of there. Open that, open that, open that, open that. Let's just vent that out. Okay, you've repaired that. That's good. You get in there, you get in there. You get back in there. Just want that to run out of oxygen. No air in there. It's got to die out. Right, there we go. Right. Close that. Right, jump to, well, I suppose to the exit. Okay. A ship refueling station is is at the beacon. You can purchase fuel here. Yeah. Um. About normal. I've got. I'm not going to use the. I'm not going to use that for the moment. Right. Let's get the air back in these compartments. Close the doors. There we go. There's air back in there, so you can move back in. It wasn't buying value though. It didn't look like value. It seemed about the same amount as I'd normally pay, didn't it? 
I thought it did. I could be wrong. Oh, okay. Maybe I should have done it. Um. I think I can get. I could do one more, and I, I'm going to move on to the next sector. Yeah. Whilst there's normally three in the shop, in the stores, aren't they? Damn it! No, you're right. Um, let's go to the civilian one. No, you're right. Should have thought of that. Okay. Um, oh, yeah, I'll sell drone parts because I don't use drones. Sweet. Always listen to King. <laughs> well, there is a delay, so... It comes through a little bit after I've sometimes already taken a decision. Sorry. Uh, no, we're going to attack the pirates. <laughs> well, there's no point in saying how deep to you, because if you say cut, that generally just means kill them. I don't need to worry about how, how deep I'm cutting. Okay, so I'm gonna fire that there. Good. Um, right, fire that there. Oh, really? Gee, ah, right, so we've got. Good, that's weapons down. I haven't got auto fire on. Oh, I must have already selected it. Uh, the more generous bribe and leave. Yeah. Yeah. Um. I still just don't use them, to be honest. One, they're good for trading later on. Really? Did I miss that many shots? Bloody hell. There we go. Ah, 38 scrap. Good, okay. Maybe you should be taking some of these. Okay, and another 30 scrap, that's good. So we need to find a store. Uh, already been there. Go there. Yeah, and you're never going to get through 99 licks. Well, actually, you've never seen me do a boss fight like that in that kind of thing. I generally need 99 elixirs. Yeah. We spot a small rebel ship nearby. It seems to have been refitted for transport rather than combat. Not seem to me want to cage a ship. Uh, let's see if we can get them to surrender. No. Okay. Right, they're trying to escape, so we need to take down their engines. Right, already damaged their engine. Why is that not helping? Ah, oh, damn it. Oh, 
Wow, they are properly charging that FTL up. Damn it, didn't get that in time. Gotta time that better. Uh, and there they go. Okay, well, I took a little bit of damage, but nothing much more. Hmm. Well, let's uh, jump to there. Hmm. Uh, scans show a remote settlement being blockaded by a pirate ship. Uh, the ship hastily messages you. Stay out of this or you'll be next. Concentrate fire on... Uh, no, I'm going to attack the pirates. Because I'm good like that. Okay, it looks like they've got a missile and a laser weapon. So, concentrate fire on there. Uh, I think I'm already the rock, my friend. <laughs> Okay, so they're going to run away and I get fueled and droid parts and scrap, so I'm actually going to do that because normally if I attack them I only get scrap. So... There's a store there. Let's try that store first. Transmission from the nearby planet indicates an outpost below which offers supplies to travellers. You send down an away party to check it out. Okay, burst laser 3, which requires 4 power, uh, but it does 5 sharp. Jeez. Or another heavy laser 1. I'm not overly impressed with the heavy laser one at the moment. That burst laser three looks quite good if I can upgrade some bits. I'm gonna I'm actually going to sell off the heavy laser, because I don't like the heavy laser. It's actually not what I'm after. Don't like it. I do want that, though. An extra point in there. I will get a rock soon, don't you worry. I'm missing that much. Right, you get in there. Open that door, that door, that door, and that door. Jeez. I miss a lot with this burst laser, you know. Come on. 
Wow. Am I really missing that much? Why am I missing so much? Oh. Um, not getting any fuel from that. I'm just, yeah, it'll go. Blow them up. Okay. In normal, hitting engines is a viable strat. Mm, okay. Right, uh, close that. Close all the doors. Shouldn't need to worry about the. Uh... Right, you go and fix that. And you go and fix that. A pair of you together should get it done fairly quickly. Right, go and heal, go and heal. Ah, uh, okay. Uh, and you're in engines, other bloke, you're in weapons, go. And jump. As you jump into the system, a pirate advances on your position. They're refusing all hails, prepare to fight. What again? Okay, that doesn't look nice. That's a lot of damage. That's a hell of a lot of damage. Keep those weapons down. After what you've just done to me, not a chance. Ah, shit. Okay, um, I can't open the doors, but you can go and... I can't open the doors. I need to fix door control. This is bad. Okay, open, 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 and open, and open. Yeah, <laughs> the entire ship on fire. Right, I can still hear the fire. Can't hear the fire anymore. Close all the doors. Go and repair that. You go and repair the healing bay, and you right. Go and repair. Go and repair. Uh, you go and start repairs on that. You go and start repairs on that. Okay, go and heal, go and heal. 
Ooh, jeez. Alright, so you go back to there. Uh, that is Anne, you go back to engines, and you go back to there. Okay, really need to... Yeah, my hull is in very, very bad shape. Uh, long range beacon... You receive a wideband message for each somatic sample anti-personnel drone. It's nice if I had a drone control. I'm going to have to jump to this store because I don't know when I'm... I've only got four hell, uh, fuel left. I've got, I've got to go there. I need to repair my hull and grab some fuel. Let's do a bit of healing. Enough to keep me going. Head up to the green. Not going to be able to do much more. Can't use that, so might as well get rid of it. Scrap recovery arm. Well, we have a. Or I could pick up an Engi or a another human. Scrap recovery arm. Yeah. Okay. I need to get the hell out. Nebula or Mantis. Well, let's try and only do one nebula if I can. Uh, I'm gonna have another one there either way. So go through there. Uh, we'll go through this bit. A poorly charged with space that's known to be home to the Mantis. Ensure your hull plating is up to scratch and that you have enough fuel in the tank to make it through the sector. Well, I don't. Uh, can't really go very far. Might as well just jump straight to that one. You spot a small rebel ship nearby. It seems to have been refitted for transport rather than combat. Uh, I'm still going to demand surrender the goods. Okay, step one, fire at that. They're on board. Me. I missed everything. Oh, crap. Mm. Yeah, they're going to disappear. Okay, that just went really, really badly. Uh, I don't know what to say there, that was dreadful. Uh, you go and repair the oxygen, and you. Oh crap, there's a bloody crack in the floor and the oxygen's out. Well, fix one and the other. Why are you still dying? Oh Jesus, that was frigging close.
Ah, of course that room didn't have any oxygen in it because of the crack in the floor, dumbass. Uh, John, go back to weapons. You go back to there. Terrible. Nearly, but not. And in all honesty, through a lot of the games I've played, you've all died numerous times. So have I. <laughs> Once more, wasn't going to really be a big difference for us. Uh, you receive a message from a nearby station. A Federation cruiser jumping into rebel territory. Quite the bold move. You quickly move to arm the weapons, but he continues. Lucky for you, we're not all in support of rebellion. Uh, perhaps these supplies will help you get to friendlier space alive. Nice. Well, for how quickly I'd have uh, killed members of uh, members of my crew off in FTL. No. Don't forget, I kill a lot of people very quickly off in uh, Gilded Engineering. That happened really fast. Okay, nearly out of fuel. Let's go to the distress beacon. You find the source of a distress call. Small research station appears a small laboratory fire got out of control and is threatening to destroy the station. Their fire suppression system is not responding. Send the rock crew member in. Cool. FGL recharge booster. Okay, not great. Lots and lots of scrap though, so that's useful. I haven't found a store. I really need to find a store. I'll do this and pray. You detect and retrieve an escape pod floating nearby. You consider returning it to space when you learn it's a mantis. Pride open. Ooh! Oh! Shit! Where is it? Okay. You get in there, you get in there, and you get in there. Open all the doors. Close that door, that door, and that door. Go. coming back up. Okay, I'm going to have to man that because I always want somebody on weapons and engines. That could have gone better. Mantis world has low chance of saw? Saw? What saw? Yes, bye bye Maxim. He be gone. Aha, store. Oh, you mean store? Found a store. Ne ne. <laughs> uh, upon arriving at the beacon, you'll help us. Well spoken, Mantis. Uh, hail, traveller. These are dangerous times. Perhaps you find yourself in need of our services. He appears to be a trader. Anti bio beam. Never seen that before. This terrifying beam does no physical damage, but it rips through organic material, dealing heavy damage to crew members. Youch. Okay. A uh, few, please, thank you. Not really worried about the FTL charger. I'm going to get rid of that. Let's do some repairs. That's useful. We could do with the evasion. 
I'm going to take the Mantis crew member. I can go back to working on shields, he can work that. And Sam's doing well on the engines. John is doing very well on weapons. I'm learning about the shields, and we now have a decent person at the helm. That's good. Turn that off, turn that on. Um, okay. Um, King Sky, would you like to be the Mantis? Please be aware, I have no disillusions at uh, us surviving this. We are all going to die. Just so you know. Just in case you didn't know that. Right, uh, I say let's get the hell out of here. We've got three fuel to find another fueling station somewhere nearby. There are a number of privately owned ship construction platforms in the area. Find one that has a slot open for some immediate work. Inquire about their speciality. Ah, I can't do it anyway. Oh, could. They offer to upgrade your door subsystem in exchange for some scrap. It's a cheap upgrade. Don't really power for it, but I'll take the upgrade. For nine scrap, that's not bad. Captain Sky sounds better. <laughs> Slug Home Nebula or Slug Controlled Nebula. I think I'll go for the Slug Controlled Nebula over the Slug Home Nebula. I hate nebulas. The slugs that live in this nebula the field are a leisure-centered civilization. Everything in slug life is done in the pursuit of more currency and more time which to spend it on extravagant ventures. This inevitably leads to much treachery in open space. Oh, goody. I could go straight to a store. Ah, okay. I'll remember that for next time. Slug home can unlock the slug ship. Right. My bad. You cautiously approach a slug colony on a huge asteroid. It's a brave person who sets foot on a slug planet. It can take weeks to get the mucus out of your clothes, but there's business to be done. Heavy laser 2. If I had the money. <clears throat> if I had the money, I'd like to get a slug. You need furl? Fuel. Fuel. I'm just going to do that. Yeah, no point in messing about with anything else. I need the fuel. You're absolutely right. Thank you. I wasn't even paying attention to that. You detect multiple ships running at maximum power nearby. But you can't see anything through this thick nebula. Ignore. Not going to try and get into a fight if we can help it. I'll go this way just because I want to do a little bit more exploring. Don't have much in the way of fuel, that's the problem. If this part of slug space is deserted or it's too dense for even slugs to detect your presence, time to move. Okay. Another store that I can't do anything with because I just don't have any fuel. A huge slug teleports from nowhere onto the bridge. Before you can open fire, he spreads the squares across the helm and is brandishing things in front of you. Um, no, no, more fuel. I'm almost broke, but I'll just buy fuel at the moment. I 
tempted to sell off the burst laser too, but I like the burst laser too. Okay, I think. Yeah, let's just let's just get out of the nebula. I think we got we did fairly well. There's no point in hanging around there to be honest. Uh let's go to the Engi homeworld. You arrived in Engi space. The fall of the Federation has brought tough times for these robotic life forms, but they're usually willing to help. Okay. You arrive near a small fleet of civilian Engi ships. A simple decryption and translation of their comm frequency tells you that they are having a frantic discussion about something obviously troubling, uh, troubling them. Um, okay, I'll ask if I can help. Slightly shocked at their question, their leader quickly responds, declined offer with apologetic gratitude. Topic of discussion, private matter, no concern of Federation. Okay. Uh, distress beacon? Hoping I can pick up some fuel on one of these things. You arrive at a smouldering Engi research station. It's distress call unanswered. Attacked by pirates or mantis, most likely. There may be someone left alive or something. Oh, oh. Uh, let's board the station. Your away team reports a wounded. Engi and a functioning drone schematic. As someone yells the space of the station reactor is overloading and they're running out of time. Save the Engi. Oh. Oh. That could be a record. Nobody saw that. Though the Engi we got was a very good pilot. Really good pilot. Um, <laughs> yeah, ca carrying on. Oh, there's a store. I need to go and get fuel. All I did was switch captains. Yeah. Message arrives. Your scrap. Your scrap as our weapons for you. I think you do deserve a reincarnation. Would you like to be the new captain? Uh, okay, lots of fuel. That's what we really need from here. I'm not worrying about anything else right now. I just need the fuel. Problem is, that's where I'm falling down. Sky the second. Uh, okay, moving on. Go to that one. Worried we might get caught here. You arrive just in time to see a unusually well-armed uh, Engi ship destroying a small pirate craft. The teleporter signal is detected. Intruder on deck. A young mantis in a charred uniform has teleported onto the deck. He begs for sanctuary from the Engi and offers to serve in exchange for your protection. The Engi have already traced the teleporter signal and offering a deal in exchange for the prisoner. political dilemma isn't it he's begging for sanctuary and if I I'm guessing that if I give him sanctuary the Engi will attack me 
Or I could just offer up the mantis. Hmm. Well, we've had it happen before, you know, uh, that somebody's, uh, just before they've left, uh, died, uh, their, their spirit has left them and they've been taken the, taking the, another body. That, that's, that's what's happened. You notice something different with, oh, with King Sky, yeah. <laughs> um, I, I, I want the bounty. Wanted the money. Yeah. Give them the, give them the mantis. The mantis are nasty. They're always attacking me. The Engi never have, so... Oh, not yet. Right, not on this run. Uh, Federation sympathizers contact you as you arrive. We know your mission should be secret, so don't ask how we know about it. Take this schematic, and it's all we can do to help. Ah, oh, okay. Let's get a good distance from there. You notice a Engi colony. It's alright, my cat's gotten into something they probably shouldn't have done. Give me two seconds, guys, sorry. Sorry guys, yeah, my uh, my daughter left a box with some chicken on the side, and my cat decided that he wanted it, so he uh, munched on it. Uh, right, booby trap the cash. Boot grade by two jumps, that's good, okay. Uh, distress beacon, always good. fuel to give you. I'd love to my friend, I would love to. Okay. Actually no, I should have gone to the store. It's alright. Uh, yeah, attack the automated ship. They've got a lot of weapons. That's a lot of weapons. Holy crap! Whoa! What the hell? What the... Frack? 
Can we not get hit for once? That would be useful. We get in there. What the um? What? You, you go and you go in there. Um, what the hell? I can't fire anything. I can't do anything to him. Give me my missiles. He's only got lasers left. You go and repair the O2. I'm I'm pretty much already dead. Yeah. We got wrecked. Okay, different ship. Start again, different ship. And we'll take the... Where's the Engie ship? Upgrade the engines. Yeah. I haven't. Um... We could have a look at Dungeon of the Endless. Hang on. Actually, yeah, let's have a look. Let's 